Yeah. What's in my bag? A little plastic container for fruit. Because every plastic bag you use in Thailand gets burnt or thrown in the ocean. So be careful with your plastic usage. Coconuts. Drinking coconuts. I don't eat the meat, but I give them to the animals. Occasionally I eat the meat, but this is another coconut. The animals in the forest really like it. They recycle some of those plastic bottles, though. Plastic bottles get recycled, yeah. plastic bags get burnt or thrown yeah. in the ocean off Cambodian coast. Yeah. So this is a beautiful coconut here. That's what a coconut should look like. The coconuts you see with pink inside, they've been cooked. And that's fine. I'm just saying if you want a raw coconut, it has to be perfect and white inside. Those coconuts you get in, in Australia or the US or Europe, when you chop them open, you're like, well, it's that pink purple stuff is because it's been cooked. And they also dip them in bleach to keep them white, otherwise they turn brown. So that's the tip there. Again. Sometimes frozen durians have that pink look too. I think some of that's part, partly to do with sulfur maybe. Or some sort of chemical. But yeah. I know the cool coconuts here when you pop, pop them open and sometimes pink inside. Yeah. Look at that durian orchard out there. That's beautiful and you can see it's yeah. organic because it doesn't have any like roundup deadness around yeah, the, the base of the tree. Durian orchard near the bus stop. Very nice. So this is a big plastic bag I use and reuse and I can put 10 kilos of mango skin in here. One put. And I wash it in the river or wash it in the lake or wash it in the shower and uh, I use this bag over and over again. So let's give it a little backpack. We should, a bit of money in here. We, should, um, we should teach your viewers some Thai. So Thai. mango steen Monkut. is monkut. Banana is guay. Hey, what's durian? Is this turian? Turian. It's like with a t. Oh, here comes a dog, God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jeez. <laughs> it's a local dog. All, most of the dogs here have got rabies. And most of them want to bite your ass. They want to bite you. So, could be fit. A fit survival or fittest. Here, little doggy. Uh, hey, Come on. Do not tease it. Doggy doggish. Do Have not tease show, show the viewers a little mutt. <laughs> if the dog's black, it means it's got rabies. Or if it's white dog, white dogs, black dogs, and brown dogs mean they get, they're all rabid. Yeah, yeah. Pretty much. I'm surprised at actually how scruffy they are here. I mean, like they're really, really feral dogs. I mean, I, and even some of the like silky terrier, like kind of like coodleish yeah. ones, are really tough, like little things. Oh, scruffies! I don't get any shots. I look after my immune system. That's what I do. Oh no, it's a demo eyes. Hey, hello. You can tell these mango steens are organic because the ants have claimed them. What I'll do is I'll get, I'll pull this mango steen out and we'll let the ants have their little mango steen treat. We'll put them in here for the little ants, so no worries. So this is Chanda Brewery Horticultural Reserve. Quite a nice little reservoir there. Got the mountains and waterfalls at the back there. Quite very scenic. 